Hey, so a lot of people are already going to be aware of MetaMask. Um, but MetaMask is basically, um, it's a browser extension. It acts as a wallet that kind of integrates into your browser. So think of it um, as a way to authenticate your identity. And uh, MetaMask will act as a key to get you into many Web3 decentralized apps, DAOs, uh, etc. So this demo, I'm going to walk you through just installing the MetaMask uh, browser extension. And then we'll set up uh, one or two different currencies and add some test currency to the wallet uh, so that it can be used to access some of these Web3 sites. So I'm going to go to metamask.io and hit download. Let's go ahead and create a wallet. I'll let you watch this video. This talks about your recovery phrase and how important it is to keep hold of it. Because what can happen is you can get your funds into your wallet and you forget your uh, recovery phrase. You get a new computer, break your phone, whatever it might be, and then you cannot access your funds. So super important. Let's go to next. So I'm going to copy this and put it somewhere that I can I can access it and remember it later on if I need. Okay, and now uh, we've got our MetaMask account set up. Okay, so now that we have MetaMask set up, uh, it is time to add some test currency to this. Uh, I am going to be uh, testing out a DAO on Aragon. Uh, they use the Rinkeby test network. So think of these networks here. Right now there's only one. We're going to show all of the other test networks. So you want to do that first. All right. Now we see all of the available uh, test networks. This is um, not an exhaustive list. You can add other networks manually. Um, that's a little bit of a process on its own. Uh, plenty of info out there on Google if you need it. So you can think of these networks as kind of like lanes on a highway. Um, within the Rinkeby network, you can have multiple accounts, right? So I've got account one. I can create another account, account two. And you can transfer between these uh, fairly easily. I think there's some gas fees involved can get kind of expensive, but um, the trick is passing uh, currency between these networks, not between the accounts within the network. Uh, so if you need to do this, uh, check out, you can just search for a bridge. Uh, let me just go crypto bridge. And we want to get some fake currency here uh, in case we need it for to sign up for the DAO, to sign transactions. Um, so just do a simple search for uh, Rinkeby Faucet. My experience, these faucets can be hit and miss, most often miss. Uh, either they're out of funds or uh, they're just not working. As you can see here, faucet offline. So I'm gonna go ahead and look around for a faucet that is working and I'll be right back. Okay, I found a faucet that has worked for me in the past, so we'll give this a try. Uh, Faucets.chain.link. We want Rinkeby, so we'll select that. We'll go to MetaMask, copy the address for our account, because this is where we want uh, this site, the folks behind it, to 
uh, to send our currency. So again, copy your address back over here, paste it in, and we don't care about link. And this can take some time. Uh, I've had it take 10 minutes plus. Sometimes it's you know 10, 10 seconds. So um, be patient. If you don't have it within 10, 15 minutes, uh, it's probably not going to work. Um, and just search around for another faucet. So let's see if our ETH has actually arrived. All right, so now that we've got some test currency, we'll go to our browser extension. Make sure to add this shortcut in your browser. Uh, we are going to make sure we're on Rinkeby Test Network. And then we'll put in the URL of our DAO. And boom, we have access. So, uh, the same holds true for any other website. If you want to go to like, uh, yeah. So example, this is a web three site. Um, you have to have this MetaMask, uh, browser extension in order to get in or to join. So a lot of these web three sites, you're going to see connect wallet, MetaMask, go to account one next. And connect. Ask us to sign. And now we can explore friends with benefits. So that's it for MetaMask. Thank you.